as you can see 10 kilometers on the gum and we're right here but it seems a really difficult place to reach I don't get these French parkings but I think I'll yeah I'll be able to do a full circle here and wow there was a very loud beep when I hit 14 kilometers uh, as you can see there's no percentage so I can just see that I'm very low so I just uh, had very little to go left and then this loud beep came and the turtle the turtle arrived as you can see here in the screen and here we are total as you can see the price is per minute here and they will explain to you why using a QR code but I'm gonna wear my mask and uh, do some fast charging let's see if these EV box EV tronic chargers actually perform can they charge up the e-tron fully and the battery will be pretty cold still because it's cold outside and I just drove 80 kilometers to get here so exciting session coming up wow so just a moment ago I tried my ENBW charging card and it didn't work then I looked in the app and the app seemed to be able to activate the charge but it didn't then I tried my card again when the app already thought I was charging and now the machine says it's working but it's not delivering any charge yet but starting the Audi getting some energy into the Audi always takes a while so maybe it's still configuring the speed somebody went to check out the machines they should ask me some questions but they didn't look at this it starts and it stops oh no a new total disaster might be incoming and I'm empty with the e-tron on the French highway and this the charging session broke off after four seconds anybody who watched my EQC adventure with the Mercedes you can look uh, you can look at the video knows that I am very used to this happening um, but Toto built this new station over here in between Paris and Lille around 80 kilometers north of Paris and it's just as beautiful as the other one but do these chargers actually work will I be able to reach the Netherlands today um, it's gonna be exciting let's try again So by now the cold battery is heating up thanks to the charging process and we're getting 141 kilowatts at the total chargers and I've never seen them perform like this so I have to say it's a good moment thank you total I'm using the ENBW charging card from Germany that's actually a great deal here but um, yeah with the e-tron actually the by the minute price that total offers is an could be an even better deal if you're charging at full speed the thing is that i tried to pay with my credit card and it didn't work so i'm still uh waiting i hope they give me my money back because they took a lot of they blocked uh, 70 euros of the credit card so yeah i don't know if i can recommend that method even though pricing 
is pretty sharp when you have the right vehicle. Time for coffee. And that was it after charging to a range of 140 kilometers and just press this beautiful button over here to stop the charge which is nice because otherwise you need to show your charging card over here and stuff to stop it look it closed by itself i really like that so yeah a successful charging session sure i had to try to connect two times but maybe it was my own fault because I was messing around with the plug in a bad way. So yeah, total, it is happening in France. They're building actual competition to Ionity. And yeah, people might think it's not cheap, but if these chargers deliver high speed, and if you brought your EMBW charging card from Germany, pricing is very fair because it's the same as in Germany sure there are, I cannot see Alpitonic hyperchargers arrive to France anytime soon but as long as this new generation of EV box chargers I think that's what they are um, because of this uh, logo over here I think this new generation uh, might be much better than the last Let's hope it's true. This is their old one. These are the specs of the new one. I'll take a photo. So yeah, if they can do nearly, nearly four, they do 400 amps. So yeah, that's uh, very serious. Every car should be able, every vehicle should be able to get their full, full spec. And here are the actual chargers. You can see it's a written EV box over there. But uh, yeah, they're, they're hidden from sight after behind this locked door. But I can you more on the video than, than I can see myself but you have seen these before in other locations so thanks total this is the beginning of what could be a, a very interesting network I'm sure and there's even I mean look at this because it's a typical French rest stop you can just have lunch outside too bad that the highway is very close but there's uh, lots of uh, food and drinks, so I'm gonna grab a coffee. Ciao.